connected. Oh, you're a great driver. Christ. And you're supposed to be smarter than me. Give me that goddamn thing. What the hell's wrong with you? I'll never get this open. Damn it. Is there emergency locks? Oh. There's no one in here. Oh, hey, little guy. Didn't expect to see you again. Oh. Alright, he's cool then. Holy Jesus. Thanks a lot, cat. You're swell. Don't worry, cat. I'll find a way to say hi. Jeez, like, what did she even crash into? There's nothing around. Except for this thing, but. Up here. Whoa. How are you? Come in, Strasky. Can you hear me? Theta, listen. Acres is headed for Theta. No building more headed. Getting a signal, but no audio. Strasky. It's Como Rigby. Anchors has gone mad. He's dangerous. The hell is Como Rigby? Strasky! Sorry, Delta. Still no audio. Try calling from another access point. Strasky? I can try setting. I have pictures. Uh-huh. As well. Still don't know what the hell these are. Oh! Finally got some life down here. How you doing, sirs? You guys don't want to hang out either, eh? Alright. What the hell is this place? Security cams. Whoa. What the hell is this now? So we just leave it on two, I guess? Oh! Hey, could you maybe help? I need to get the data. Give me some money. Listen. Make yourself useful. Okay, then. Are you a person? Yeah. You put in a good word for me? <laughs> I'm not sure that's a good thing. Nah. I'm just messing with you. Okay, he's gone nuts. Light is hurting my eyes. He's telling me I don't need this vitreous flesh inside my skull to see salvation. I will gladly remove them. Stop them from obfuscating this divine mission. It's exciting to watch Woe claim Delta. Half a year ago, I'd be worried. I'd have Goya and Juan clean the black blood from the machinery. Now its crusty surfaces seem to complement even outshine what Delta was. Oh, let's play some chess. 
Oh. Yeah, it's usually the case. My reflection in the black blood of our warden whispers. I need to save them from this hell. Let them sleep. Lock them in the lucid dreams I've seen. There's a couple creepy writings. Not much else. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. Oh. Zeppelin's on its way. Better get ready. What? Oh, jeez. Oh, shit! Let me see it! Where is it? I'm not seeing a Zeppelin. Holy fuck! What the hell? Is this what I'm being transported on now? Disconcerting popping in and out of existence like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Course, and the millions of Delta. signs around that say Delta, but... You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Yes. Ah, uh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Of course. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. We have to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Oh. Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips. The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us the chip. So... I'm okay with being a robot now? What the fuck? Uh-oh. Guess I have no choice. Oh, God. Let's go kill that one guy who was talking to himself. May as well. Put him out of his misery, right? I'm not killing him. Where's that other guy? There we go. How you doing, sir? Come to check your temperature. Oh, come on. Oh, that didn't work. Where you going, dude? I'm sorry. She told me to. She told me! He's going down. Holy! Alright. Go ahead and grab his chip. This works. It's alright. He was losing his mind anyway. And there you go. You're sick, by the way. Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We'd, we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was... talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since yeah, I but... up at Upsilon. Just 
keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, what the fuck yeah, is your sure. problem? Getting into a deep convo here and you're like, yeah, well, whatever. There's monsters and robots. You fucking pussy. Like, can we go? Is Frank coming? Yeah, may as well call the robot Frank. I guess he's pissing off. See you, Frank. Thanks. Yeah, no problem, weirdo. I mean, where was the part that I was cool with being a robot? I don't know. There goes Delta. We're on to Theta. You know, hoping this thing doesn't screw up. I'm sure it will. You're really good back there, Simon. We got a slight Delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Theta. Then we just head inside, grab the duck back, and head down the abyss. Oh. 4,000 meters. Oh. That's a long way. We don't have to worry, though, or... because with the Dunbat, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. That's great. And <laughs> you can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I, I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. Okay. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me go? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? All right. Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Calf, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. It's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Yeah, no shit. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? Well. See you soon. Oh, we're here. Nice. I don't want to forget this again. Oh, this place is just as big. I don't know, like. Again, simulation? I'm trying to make sense of this. So I go into Dr. Munchie's office, sat in a chair, boom, I'm gone, and I wake up here. Like, is all this a test? Like a stress test? Or what the hell's going on? It's either that or. Something screwed up, and he's sold my brain, or a scan, I, I don't know. Strasky, wake up Dr. Masters, we're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? He's had a rough day. Yeah, he just killed everybody. <laughs> he's all butchered by structure shrapnel. The bio church and the number on him. Brandon, flip the panic switch on the seat. I don't want to burn through the oxygen. You're kidding, right? He's fucking hanging on by a thread. We need to move him. 
Strasky, get the infirmary ready. We need to move fast. Wait. Where are Kumarabi and the others? This is all we got. I guess it's still at Delta. Mm -hmm. I can't do this on my own. Grab the other side. Strask, ready or not, we're coming in. All right. See you soon. This thing on? Can everyone hear me? Go ahead, Strom. Listen up, all members of staff. The art project has caused a lot of arguments the last few months. I'm not going to pretend I understand what the hell Sarang talked about and how his continuity suddenly made sense to kill yourself. For the fucking love of God, or whatever you think is important, mm -hmm. don't kill yourself. This place is miserable enough. Don't force your friends to clean up your blood. Rest in peace. Quality. Good? Beautiful, sir. All right, everyone. Show's over. Get back to work. The hell, dude? Every time I listen to another thing, it's just more questions. That's it, I'm going in. I need an answer. Christ's sake. This first. Damn it. Oh, whoops. There we go. What's behind this behemoth? Another door. There we go. Oh, security cam's still on. Who the hell's here? Gotta throw something. There we go. Yeah, I guess we'll go in one first. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. I if this see. is one of a kind, then how did they get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. Oh, another I one. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. They could walked it? down to the abyss. Like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know... Like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? 
You don't have to pretend it's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself. Yes. Attached to a pro fueled by solar panels, it could survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... it's... Heroic? Uh, at least it feels worth doing. Here we go. The Dunbat. Oh. Uh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure. Let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. Oh, thanks. We need to find someone who knows the cipher. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. Alright, so I'm leaving you here, right? Okay. Nice. Let's go find some answers. Like, should I be touching these? I don't know. <sighs> Gone this far. What the hell are you doing? I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. Helps me focus. That's... I, I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up I to. thought so. I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. Let's just keep going. I knew it. Something's gonna fuck up. And it's gonna be my mind. As if it wasn't bad enough. Oh, God. What happened to all the people? This place looks deserted. So far. It doesn't make any sense. Theta is clearly the best option for survival. Ooh. Oh! Oh, is that asshole here? Sounds like he's here. Where the hell did they all go? Theta is out of the picture. Where would you go? Probably Lambda or Omicron? Well, we've seen Lambda already. Maybe Omicron. Just like some answers. I don't need flamethrowers or rocket launchers. Just answers. Yeah, see, there's something going on with me connecting to this and whatever the hell the doctor's doing. It's gotta be a sim, dude. Just remember, there was something about. Doing things over and over again without affecting the brain. Could have done without that. I'm gonna makeshift basketball. Guy Conrad. Fucking thing out of here. What's up, guy? You got any answers for me? Yeah. Private office. Jeez, another one. Holy. There's Catherine. Hey, that's Myra. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. So, why don't you want them? I don't know about her. Oh, here's one right here, cat. Missing his arm, but the teddy bear could use some repairs. Toby always breaks. He's top heavy, so he keeps falling over. Oh. Well, I'll just leave him up there. I seriously doubt you'll find anything useful in there. Oh. Why do you want me out so quick? You have a lot of toys. Huh. 
What's in here, huh? Oh, we got a journal. A Mogan Reed tested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW. But more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way. Like someone had specifically created it for WoW to steal. When activated, the machine mimicked the room and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as a simulation inside the digital space. See? Fuck! The presentation shocked Reed and was quickly terminated. It scares me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. I have it. I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked with the vivarium, but I can replicate WoW's scanning technique using the pilot seats. It was even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to follow the diffraction and high energy needed to capture the scan. I suspect WoW has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and used it as a basis for intelligence in the machines. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we have now officially started the ARC project. We are to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule. Then we will launch it into space using the space gun. It's nice to think something will live on like that. Mark Sarang killed himself after his scan. He has been suggesting everyone should kill themselves, as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the Ark. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff, and apparently it's my fault somehow. Strohmeyer is not happy with me. I hope it will calm down. Hmm. So how the hell am I here? Oh, there he is. Strohmeyer. So this is the guy who was telling everybody to kill themselves? What he's got to say for himself. Oh. Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? They typically don't stay with us till we die. Some live a few days while others live a few years. We're not affected by their short lifespans, as they're replaced by new cells which help sustain our bodies. I don't think anyone would argue that we ever lose our persona due to this process. Yet we are clearly in a constant state of transformation. <laughs> then how do we remain the same? A continuous flow of thought and perception keeps an unbroken chain of continuity that we know as our self. Our conscious mind is not the pattern of our brain but a continuous, emergent entity based on that pattern. When Dr. Chun populates the Ark, she is capturing a moment of our existence and placing it inside the digital world. Soon you and your digital you will grow apart due to diverging experiences, but for a tiny window, you are the very same. With unbroken continuity, it will live on. A fulfilling life, no doubt, no less real than the one from which it was plucked. Now remember, you are not your body. You are the emergent entity. That entity just happens to occupy two places at once for a while. If you took away your body, you would simply be the only one you can be. The you inside the Ark. Let your body die and continue on in the digital paradise among the stars. Hmm. And here's Mark. Leaving his final note for everybody. I mean, I get what he's saying, but... I don't... Ah, Jesus. What are the revelations going to be for all this? 
Robin Base. Nice photo right there. Oh. We're all dying anyway. I'm all in. I put my faith in Sarang and the continuity. See, that's just a render of the arc. Hmm. Oh. Nice bed. Jeez, this is like obsessed much. Martin Fisher. Oh, looks like his room's fucked. Okay, I know it's probably a bad idea at this point, but. Flash is getting worse. Kind of felt like. Oh my god. What was that? Missed it, damn it! Going up now. I think we are. chair. The pilot chair. Oh. This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab. The scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. Holy! I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Oh. How is he that size? I haven't seen shit to eat down here. I'm like, walking to the kitchen is no easy feat. In these parts, so... Oh, I see. Dude, why are you 300 pounds? Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. Are you sure, though? Nancop? Oh. Wait, what? The compressed Nakajima neurograph. Captured March 12th, 2014. Uh oh. This is getting a little crazy. Same thing. The pace files. I didn't. Oh fuck. The so Paul Berg, April twenty eighth, two thousand fifteen. That was like four or five days before my meeting. Should I race this? And look who it is. Oh shit. Munchie. How did this... 
What is this? How was he there? Or oh, maybe they just captured it? Were they, like, farming people? What the fuck? Kath, what is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munshi's templates. A legacy scan. So I'm... I'm definitely dead then. What the fuck? Oh, here it is. Okay, that's it. Wow. That was fun. That's a relief. Still figuring this out, so... Wait, what? It's freaky. So many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are gonna run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. Ha ha ha. He only knew. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Way. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking yep, aspirin. So I'll just take this claw started. hammer to the back of your head. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're going to keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. Oh, man. What's... The model was sound. It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah. Who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Oh, like fuck. Organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. Everything up till now. The brain damage. You guys, everything. It's made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope... ...wasted. Holy Christ on a crosswalk. I don't want to leave this screen. What's a legacy scan? They're historic templates for AI construction. Any self-respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're great for learning. They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. Oh my god. What the hell? Erase all this now? Yep. That's it. Munchie, you're gone. You no, know I said you could use it. This is fucked. So it's He's official. The real Simon is dead. And I'm a replica of that scan Munchie did, thinking he's Simon. What did you expect? I don't know. I, I don't know what I was hoping for. An explanation? Maybe an apology? Oh, uh, I, I'm sorry. Not from you. I, well, thanks, I guess. Mm -hmm. I deleted the file, so hopefully I'll be the last Simon to suffer through this place. Ready to move on? Yeah. Let's go. I guess. Oh. You know, I'm not feeling the greatest. Oh. Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Cozy. Oh. What the hell's this? Oh, it's a webcam. Cover that up. So... A comet hit the Earth. 
I'm dead. And... I guess that's all I was wondering. Oh man, this is... This is some heavy shit. Where the hell does this tape go? Oh. Need to fix that mainframe connection. Oh, is that over here? This is where I would store the ARC scans. Are they similar to my legacy file? No, yours is flatter, if that makes sense. Less dynamic. Thanks. That makes me feel much better. Um... Don't Damn. need that one. Don't need that one. Not that one either. Broken. I guess I'll know when it looks good. There we go. An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Hey, well, hold your horses. There might be more. I don't know. My brain is just... I don't know. I can't even explain. I feel like I'm getting scanned myself. And I'm in another dimension. How's that one? So now it's in there. Hmm. So how do I connect to the main frame? Okay, I guess I'll go look around. Oh! Oh, that was just the lighting. Okay. report filed by the staff mentioned struggling with something called a proxy. The proxy we killed was blind, just like Acres, but it listens. Careful, we spotted two more by the infirmary. What do they look like? Not sure. It seems to be human enough to pass for a crew member at a distance. Tall, dark, and ultimately faceless. Oh, yeah. Be what to look out for. I'll keep my eyes open. I think I've seen them. And I don't want to look at them. Server access this is probably it. Holy Jesus. Looks like the WoW got a hold of this big time. Uh, at least I'm less confused. I don't think I'm getting back up. So, not that one first. Alright. Yeah, this is looking promising. Oh! Yep. Yeah. Hey, it looks like I have to talk to it. is it now? Just the... weird guys I've already been facing, or...? Oh. Good lord. 
Lord. That is different. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Shouldn't have my flashlight though. Oh god. There it is. Main frame. Tell me I have to go all the way back up. Okay. I take your sweet time. There's only shit from Silent Hill down here. No rush. No rush. Are you fucking serious? What? Good. Yep. 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 I'm out of here. I'm hoping the mainframe is on. That. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathwork already etched into the base. So, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't well. used to work like that. Truly sentient machines, thinking they are people, is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Huh. Well, there's Mark. Suicide. Louise. Nathan, holy, look at them all. Strohmeyer reprimanded me. One more death and we're out. Guy Conrad. Project on hold indefinitely. Anyone who could know a security cipher. Okay. Very promising. I'll just load them up and get the simulator going. Okay. There we are. Is that actually what him? We exactly. We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Uh, let's go to the ski lodge. Okay. Perfect. Oh, so bad. Strohmeyer really got me worked up, bastard. 
What? What is this? Where am I? Everything is okay, Mr. Wong. Just relax. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? I need a favor. I need to know what the new security cipher is. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. It's not for me. I'm trying to save the Ark. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Charo. Punch your teeth in. Oh. Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. Oh, jeez. Really gonna put him through all this? That wasn't so bad. This trauma really got me worked up, bastard. What? What is this? Where am I? Take a deep breath, Mr. Wan. Everything is fine. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? I need your help. I have to get the new security cipher. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. I'm trying to save a lot of people. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Charo. Punch your teeth in! This setup won't work. We need something else. Uh, the beach? That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me working. Yeah, this is way more normal. What? How did I get here? Welcome back, Mr. Wan. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Listen, I really need your help. I need the new security cipher. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here! It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real! This isn't real! I have to get out of here! Oh, this one looks like it's working. Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So? What's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Okay, how about no environment? That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chun? What happened to I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Mr. Wan, I need you to stay calm. No, 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 no. Why, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! God damn it! I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. Um, maybe I take it to the other one? Hiya. Oh yeah. Let's check all these. All right, I think we're good. Okay. Scan room. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Congratulations, Mr. Wan. The scan was successful. Chun? Where's Alice? She's fine. Never we mind. Time, Fuck, Mr. dude. Wan. I need the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is a trick. No, it's okay, I promise. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow, you hear me? You won't break me! Are you serious? How many times are we gonna have to do this? Come on, Simon, don't give up now. Holy hell. I don't guess I'm going to look around for another slot.
You know what? Go look for Brandon's room. Oh. Let's do some investigation. I'm sure we can get to him somehow. Okay. Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Oh. Would have been helpful the first time. If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Oh. It's got a castle or something. Albuquerque? Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Strasky and Alvaro to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, and I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. Heard some lady telling oh. Brandon to hurry up. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. That's Alice Coster. Wouldn't have guessed they even knew of each other. Interesting. Fairchild Award for Achievements of the Engineering Youth. Hmm. Not there. Brandon, I'm really a mess thinking about the scan. Everyone is being so brave. All smiles, no regrets. You know how you said you would hold my hand during the scan? If the offer still stands, I greatly accept. If we do it together, we could suffer the hangover together as well. I say it takes a couple of days to recover. Kisses Alice. There's a note from Alice that makes me think she was scanned alongside Brandon. Okay, oh. that sounds really promising. We can definitely use that. Security clearance. This, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Mm. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. I found more evidence suggesting they were together during the scan. That's okay, Sherlock. We got it already. We oh. Focus on simulating Brandon Wan. Oh, okay, I'll get the fuck out of here then. Sorry. Jesus. Okay, I now we good. Module that we can use. So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. All right. Guess I'll just watch. Scan room with Alice. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Strohmeyer. He said he needed a new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. Wait. Oh my God, this Didn't guy. Did he just tell you to take it easy? Don't, Don't worry, I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel I'm over. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. DeLong. Brandon. Goodbye. What do you mean? No, wait. Oh. So let's just screw him over anyway. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. It's only best. Rest in peace, Brandon. Jesus. This is fucking crazy. So do I need these? It's not anymore. This is a shite. Simon, we got it. We can get to the dumbbat now. Get back here. Alright, I'm going. Jeez. Order me around. So, you're not worried that there are other Simons or Catherines running around out there? Now I am. Jeez, Simon. Some thoughts are better left alone. 
Oh, great. So you didn't actually know you were just telling me shit. Oh, no. Well, the questions are back again. There you are. Just warming up the dumb back for us. It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Alright. Oh. Oh. Okay, that's it. That beast. That's everything. Let's go ahead and... Huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. What Wait, what's we weird? Do? Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now. And get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the Abyss. Sounds easy enough. Sure it won't be. Yeah, Alright. Let's get this Dunbat going. Kind of looks like the robots. Thought it would be a little bit bigger. What the hell's going on here? Oh. There we go. Well, the Dunbat has come alive. Great. Oh, shit. 